In this video, I want to demonstrate how to make this revolve cut feature. So first, I'm going to control tab back to my other part. And I want to sketch in this plane I've created 3 8 above the part. So with the plane, select it. I'm going to go to the features ribbon and select revolve cut. So SolidWorks knows I want to sketch in this plane and I'll look normal to it. And I just want to use a two point rectangle to create this cut. So I'm going to select two point rectangle. I'm going to click out here, move over, click here, push escape to stop creating it. And I'd like this on center, so I'm going to right click on this entity here and tell it to select the midpoint. I'm going to hold control, select the origin, and I'll make these coincident. Next, I'll use mouse gestures to activate smart dimension. I'm going to dimension this side 87 thou, and I'll make the length of the rectangle 7 16 So my sketch is fully defined. I'm going to rotate around a bit and zoom out. I'll right click now and I'll exit my sketch. Because there's no center line, SolidWorks isn't sure what the axis of revolution is. So I'm going to come out here, I'm just going to zoom in a bit, and I'll select this line as the axis of revolution. And I'm only going to have it sweep through 180 degrees. And that shape will now be cut into the top of my part when I select OK. I don't want to see my plane anymore either, so I'm going to hide it. And now I've made a revolve cut into my part.